So, what do we got here today? Sir, people believe that drinking milk isn't natural for them, sir. What else? They ask, why do we drink milk, sir? Alright, I might have some acne because I started drinking milk again recently, but drinking milk into adulthood is perfectly natural if it doesn't make you shit your pants. Because if it does and uh, you still guzzle down milk every day, then you have bigger issues than lactose intolerance, in my humble opinion. Believe it or not, milk is a complete food, meaning that you, as you are now, could technically, theoretically, survive on milk alone for some time, although I wouldn't recommend trying it. So let's look at how milk drinking started. In the distant past, people were just hunting and gathering, and the only point in life where they came into contact with milk was childhood. But after we started domesticating animals some 12,000 years ago, more or less, we suddenly had a reliable source of milk, so why not give it a shot? I have to say, not usually a chocolate milk fan, but this one is really good. Mm. And apparently someone back then must have liked milk, as I do now, because we still drink it today. Another reason might be that being able to digest lactose gave you a massive advantage in the harsh environment thousands and thousands of years ago. And by natural selection, lactose tolerant people outnumbered lactose intolerant people in the specific areas of the world where herding was a thing. And since this was all a natural progression, like there were no aliens that forced us to drink it, I hereby declare drinking milk as a completely natural adult human activity. Now, to address the potential health issues with milk consumption, like cancer and whatnot, according to biased and unbiased research, there are none, except for neutral to a slightly increasing effect on potential prostate cancer development. But the same study also says that drinking milk has a positive effect on all the other more common types of cancer. Positive for you, meaning that if you drink milk it can potentially hinder future, for example, colon cancer development in your body. Another argument might be that we are the only animals who do milk drinking as adults, and I believed this to be true until today, when I found out that African feral cats have been observed, have been caught in the action as they were stealing milk directly from an elephant seal's teeth. So I guess we are not the only species. Now, I'm not saying that locking hundreds of animals away in a factory farm is completely natural. That's something else. I was just talking about milk consumption. Of course, if you would like to get yourself all the vitamins and minerals and proteins and fat contents that milk should have, buy yourself a cow and have it grazing all year round. Or at least buy yourself raw or minimally processed milk, meaning no homogenization and gentle pasteurization. But if you don't have the cash for that, then you don't have much choices left. Mm. Also, this wasn't dietary or medical advice, so you should definitely do some of your own research or at least consult your doctor before suing me about dairy consumption. Thank you for watching.